Hi, I'm Mr. Wu Mingyo. Okay, uh, I'm going to talk about the principle of moment. Basically, this, uh, this principle of moment states that when a body is in equilibrium, meaning when it's balanced, the sum of clockwise moments about a pivot is equal to the sum of anti-clockwise moments about the same pivot. So what does this mean? Let's look, take a look at this example on the right. Okay, uh, let's say I have a beam that is balanced on, uh, on pivot and uh, it's acted on by two forces here. Okay, uh, this two Newton force is going to create a clockwise moment. And this one Newton force is going to turn this way around the pivot. So it's going to be a anti-clockwise moment. So let's calculate the two moments. The clockwise moment in this case it will be is equal to force times distance which is 2 times 50 cm this will give us 100 newton cm and the anti-clockwise moment is equal to 1 newton times 100 cm this will be 1 times 100 this will also equal to 100 newton cm so when the clockwise moment and the anti-clockwise moments they are equal, this whole pin it will balance. Okay, let's look at a real life example. Okay, I have a I have a balance here. So now let me put two weight to simulate two newton at the 50 cm position. As you can see, this is going to give us a clockwise moment and the beam has already turned clockwise. Okay, now, let me put a 1 Newton weight at the 100 cm position. This is going to create an anti-clockwise moment that is 100 Newton cm. And let's take a look at what happens next. The beam actually balances. Because of principle of moment, it states that the sum of clockwise moment about this pivot is equal to the sum of anti-clockwise moment about the same pivot.